Yo, 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 we back once again with the True Hip Hop Podcast. It's your boy, DJ Blaze. And that guy again. Wolverine, <laughs> and we back for episode 539. We ready to shine. We right on time. But before Clock we me. get started, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Right now. Like, comment, and share. Come on, give it to your friends. That helps us out tremendously on the algorithm. Oh, Me and Wolf appreciate all the love y'all been giving us. But y'all cats ain't been subscribing, so hit that, that bell. bell. Bing, it's us. And make sure it's all notifications, you heard me? All right, man, we just been to just dive into these YouTube streets, man. In the first nine months of 2023, Sean Diddy Combs triumphantly performed at the MTV VMAs and released the R&B album that geared a Grammy nomination and was suited to buy BET Network. But several lawsuits filed last year raised allegations of sexual assault and rape against Combs, one of hip hop's most recognizable names as a performer and a producer. The music mogul homes in Los Angeles and Miami were searched Monday Federal agents with Homeland Security investigation and other law enforcement officials said the searches were connected to investigation by federal authorities in New York. The the officers spoke to the Associate Press on conditions of immunity because they were not authorized to publicize, discuss details of the investigations. Combs attorney and other representatives did not immediately respond to the request for comment and his whereabouts are unknown. Although Diddy was embroiled in one of high profile business disputes in 2023, it was a case filed by his former girlfriend, R&B singer Cassie, that opened up the door to the claims of sexual violence. Combs has denied the allegations. And it's not clear whether the search is related to the allegations and the lawsuits, which include one from a woman who claims Combs raped her when she was only 17. Man, my thoughts on this, bro, is it's a, I'm not, it's, what's up with New York where all this, every black man, they hire, they now on sex trafficking? Yeah. They give that's is it's, that it's, it's, it's two parts to this braid thing. Okay, the lawsuit with the uh, little rod dude, he triggered it. He the one called the FBI and was like it's like tapes in these in these house. He used to live there and he wanted them to investigate it and check it out. And then we got the 17 year old which is suing him cuz she said allegedly she was 17 and got flown out to uh, New York. From Michigan. From Michigan, and they gang raped her. But the raids, they're looking for this stuff in his crib, you know. They trying to put a um, case on him because if the feds is involved in something like this, it's got to be serious, bro. It's serious, but not necessarily. get involved like that. Bro, you can't say that. Because they prosecuted R. Kelly without even no evidence. No, the evidence was witnesses. That was the evidence, you know. But how all of a sudden now Cassidy make this lawsuit and it opened up the floodgates for all these other allegations? Right. So my thing is, why wasn't it not being published? Well, why wasn't it being charged when? These actions happened. Now, this girl right. saying that she's seven, she was 17, and this was back in 2000 and what, three? three? So, you talking about 21 years before. If you was raised 21 years, see, I, I have a problem with if you rape and then you don't report it. Right away. Right away. I have a problem with that because that's yes. one of the steps that they tell you is... Go to, you, the go to the hospital, get, the get rape. a rape kit, and then therefore they run an investigation. Right. But 21 years later, bro, there's no evidence. I mean, even if right. she did go and do the right procedures, they still will have this evidence stored. And that's what I wonder what if 
How can you convict somebody of something 21 years ago? But it can happen because we've seen it happen with Bill Cosby. Because Bill but Cosby and she, R. Kelly. Why it is only African-American males being prosecuted on this when it's a whole hist a history of rock bands, country singers, alternative yeah, bands. All types of white people. But they're not getting prosecuted. They're not being Why targeted. Why is it the uh, Nickelodeon people being prosecuted? The Drake Bell do and the Snyder do. Oh, y'all know what he did? Like it's like y'all are witch hunting on New York is going male. off a lot of black males. I mean, where are, where uh, uh, Bill Cosby was prosecuted? New York. Where are Kelly Q? New R. Kelly York. main uh, New main. New York. Now they going after now. P. D. Come on now. It has to be. New York is still a racist uh, uh, state. You know that, yeah, right? Yeah, definitely. So they only, they only like Irish and they like Italians. Because they know they can't get away with it in them other states, you know? And that's why the R. Kelly thing was dropped in Chicago. Chicago you know? and everywhere else. But in New York. <laughs> but in New York. He, where he got the biggest numbers. Yeah. I don't and, understand. And I don't agree with, oh, you flew somebody from another state to have sex with her in this day. It's... Crossing. Now it's That's illegal trapped. for all these all these cats. Only if they was minors, it's illegal. It's illegal if it's no matter where you at. If right, you minor. Minor is a minor. That's illegal. Period. But they trying to say she was a minor, bro. How do we know? Yeah. Well, the picture said two thousand and three. So the two picture says two thousand and three. It could when is her birthday in two thousand and three? That's what they have to look at. You have to look at it. When her birthday in two thousand? Because she could have just turned eighteen. Right, you gotta see what what how she could have. She, she could have been the when he flew her out. She could have just been. He could have flew her out on her birthday. <laughs> that could be possible. And though. she's eighteen at that point of time. Yeah. Now I don't. But agree. she's saying she's seventeen. Come on, man! You have to show me proof. I don't, man. Listen, you, you can't to... tell me that the sky is is red and expect me to believe that. But that's the same thing they got R. Kelly on, and it seemed like every I don't time have to, I don't a agree famous with it. celebrity. Is getting in trouble. It's the same fucking State. play. It's the same play. Sex trafficking. And, they, hold on. And they, <laughs> sex trafficking. <laughs> what was R. Kelly charged with? Sex trafficking, racketeering. What, what was his, his most time? Uh, the racketeering. The racketeering in New York got him the most time. They going after P. Diddy. Why aren't y'all hitting Donald Trump up? Oh, uh, yeah. He's in a lot of trouble, bro. Donald Trump owe $487 million to this lady. Why isn't he locked up? That's a thing. Like, Explain this to me. Explain I'm, this to me. But y'all going after Bill Cosby, who was going to buy... Uh, NBC. NBC. Well, You're going after... Going by, uh, BT. BT. But so then, why every time they finna buy a TV station? R. Kelly was just was going broke. He was just broke, and he didn't he didn't have true comprehension on anything. Yeah, he got railroaded. He got railroaded. So they they placed these same charges on Bill Cosby, and he's out. Yeah, but do you think they're gonna convict Diddy off this? No, shit? no, nothing. No, I think they I think they no. want him to go to jail now. They want money, bro. It's nah, not about jail, he bro. He can pay the money easily. They want to humiliate he him. He can't pay man. the money because he's still Leon, uh, twenty-two million. You mean Clyde Davis? Clyde Davis, excuse me. Clyde Davis, twenty-two million. Yeah, that's who the one put the. Play. That's who stood. That who's put it all in the play. Yeah. NBC put it in the play for Bill Cosby. Uh, Clyde Davis put it in the play mm -hmm. for. Uh, for Cassie Lawrence. Playing Cassie for 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 Diddy and R. Kelly. It was just... No, oh, that was Jay-Z. That was Jay-Z. You know? And... But... They said he tried to escape and flee on the plane, man. Who? P. Diddy? Yeah. I mean, it's not he tried to escape. He didn't he have no one to wear. If you can go to the Caribbean, they can't expedite you back. No, they that's can't. That's what um, that's Russell Simmons did. He yeah. went to Belize. Yeah, that's where he... Uh, yeah. That's where uh, Diddy at now, too. <laughs> Cause uh, hey, they they got a uh, word for uh, Russell Simmons now. They want him to come back to New York. <laughs> yeah, uh, for what? They got a fake. So he got the same case. He got one too. <laughs> yeah. So the why? My question is my my question is is why aren't no rock band artists? Because they white man. It's an attack on the black male. That's why. Brilliant. But how old was Britney Spears? 
before she she was on Nickelodeon. She went through the same trauma. Yes. Why ain't they prosecuting the Nickelodeon dudes, man? All the I'm stuff not, they I'm said not, they did. See, they should be up. They should be all over the news like Pity Liddy. They need see, to search their computers, it man. It cannot be double standards. Because bro. they're white. That's why they ain't doing that. So then I mean, to me. That's to why me, Donald to Trump me, in the position to he me, in. To me, he should be under the prison. To me, that's giving us. Instead of scrutinize P Diddy, we need to go ahead. Well, I'm not gonna say if he's if he's if he's guilty of these charges, he should serve his time. But you cannot tell me if a white guy goes in and steal a Snickers bar, he gets a ticket. But if I, as a black man, go and steal a Snickers bar, you I go, go to jail. jail. <laughs> yeah. Tell me that ain't a because that's thing. how it been since. So we should since, accept that, that though, bro. We no, we shouldn't. But it's racist. We live in a racist country. But should we They've still been, accept these what things? What can we do about it? In 2024, it's 2024. What's the suggestion Slip, to fight Slavery back? is supposed to end it 300 years ago. And it looked like it's getting worse. It's getting worse. Uh, you would think in they 2024 not, they no it would be better than what it was in 1960. But they still doing the same plays. They still killing us in the and streets. And taking out our leaders. Instead of hanging us, they They're shooting us with guns with the police. You know what I'm saying? Taking they out putting our all these crimes. The Klan went underground. The Klan had finances. The Klan finances. is the fucking police. And they have finances. And there's some of these uh, lawyers uh, and, and doctors. And, That's and, who the and Klan politicians. is. And politicians. That's all who they are. They want to hide behind a fucking mask. But oh, uh, Bill Clinton and and Hillary. You know they was racist from the jump. No, they played us, man. They no, they didn't play us. Y'all yes, didn't. They we did. we they didn't see the play. whole black Bill, community, bro. Bill Clinton. Bill, Bill Clinton act like he was playing for black people stinging. No, the you looked at it. No, on, yeah, on but you look. Hall, but we gotta look at it. Everybody was like, "Oh, he's the first black president." No, but you gotta look at his. He's the first president to enforce these ninety percenters. We didn't know that. Search though. and frisk. He no, put more people behind in that. prison than any president ever existed. But nobody knew that. Nobody knew that back then. Motherfuckers couldn't really read and shit back then. It wasn't shit in the newspapers about that. Make it so that. crazy the NAACP gave Bill Clinton a freaking reward. Award. Because they thought he was for us. But bro. they didn't look at his track record. No, you cannot he, tell he, me. Once he got in presidency, he signed all that shit. You know? They gave him the award but before we gotta get presidency. Back to, um, cause we run That's what we're saying on the double standards, man. It's just double but standards, did bro. He, he Okay. He had no proof. There's no proof of this. The girl, we got to find out her age. Were you really 17 at the time? Now, if she was 17, she's, he's wrong. He's wrong. You know? But in New York, 16 is the legal age. No, but it's supposed to be 17. 17 is the legal like age. I was telling you, the federal age in the United States is 18. And that's what they're trying to get them on. That's why they're going through all of this. You know? So why is it not... I'm, I, this is double standards to me, y'all. If y'all agree with me or disagree with me, just leave a comment because I feel like it's double standard. I don't agree with crimes being committed. I don't believe, I don't agree with no woman being harmed or molested. But it's procedures and steps to do that, to handle this. If you're going to leave in the police, don't make a civil suit against it. Put a criminal suit against it where you should have went ahead and did the right steps. When he got attacked. That's what New York messed up at. Saying that you can sue for a crime that happened a long time ago. But you can't press charges? Wouldn't you want the person that <laughs> in jail? But you $30 million will make it go away, right? Make money will make it go away. Now you ain't having those nightmares. <laughs> I'm rich. I'm, I'm, I'm now you, they become pillow dreams of hunters. Yeah, that's why I think the whole thing is bullshit. Because if something happened to you, you should have reported it. Then, Instantly. Then. And now you came out after Cassie, you know, and the girl that got shot by Shine, she saying he did it. She came out after Cassie. The little Rod dude said he was molested by Diddy, you know. Hey, they got a new term for no Diddy. Yeah, I know no Diddy term. <laughs> I just don't feel like it's. I don't want to. And I and I and I. I don't want to scrutinize the man until I see hard evidence. If I see evidence, then yeah, he deserves everything that you yeah. did. Yeah, 
you guilty until proven innocent. Yeah, that's how that's the, as a black man it is. And you see what the media the media do it. Yeah. They easily do it. It's all over. Uh, I, I, yeah, everywhere. they did. They, they you guilty they automatically. They guilty. Everywhere. They're black. All they guilty. They get R. Kelly the same way. Everywhere. Bill Cosby. Everywhere. <laughs> like damn. but none of these Nickelodeon guys or nope. none of these other they rock bands. I have. You I need. To. I only heard about the Nickelodeon starting this week. You really. And they've been saying that Raven Simone been saying that. Even Orlando Brown been saying that. Right. So they rolled him off. It's crazy. But get on way below, man. Let us know what y'all think, man. Do you think Diddy is innocent or guilty? Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, man. Yeah, you, yeah, you. Yeah. Shout out to the city. We out of here. One love. Peace. Peace.